this box weighs more than me. Hey guys, I'm going to be unboxing 20, that's right, 20 K-pop albums. This is probably going to be part one, so part two will be on its way, but let's get started. Do you have skeezers? Do I have skeezers? Uh, yes. <laughs> You're very prepared. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> one eternity later. Do you trust me? Why do you think I'm in the room? <laughs> I'll do the forks and things for that. Yes, forks, we appreciate you. All the albums are here. All 20 of them. I'll probably show you all the free gifts I got first because like they're just super amazing. Hey guys, okay, so this is my first time ever voiceovering, so bear with me. Okay, first off the bat we have Yongbin from SF9. And then we have the whole SF9 gang with Mamma Mia. Then we have Monster X with Who Do You Love? And then we have Hang Won. And then we have um Kian and Minyak. And then we have all of NCT 127, I believe. And then we have Jayan. And then Jamin, my bias. So cool. And then we have Chanyeol. And then we have 17, a group photo of them. And then Minho, or the 8 as well. And then we have another group photo of 17. And that's all of them, so yay. Who to start with first? I think we're going to start with 17. First off, we're going to start with the semicolon album by A17. On the back here is the special album. So yeah, this is like a mystery box kind of album. Well, not mystery box, but like you don't know who you're going to get on the cover. It's similar to the like um, Got Seven Lullaby album where it was like a member on the front cover. So <laughs> I would love to get my bias woozy, but I would also just love to get anyone regardless. I'm going to unbox it like this, so I don't know. I'm happy with that. I love DK. So yes, in this album I managed to pull DK and I'm super excited about that because DK is also one of my biases. And in this, I had no idea what it was at first. I thought there was a CD, so yeah. I'm feeling something and I don't know why. Oh, it's all... <laughs> oh, what is that? I don't know. Weird. Yeah, so to my surprise, this was a weaving kit. I could have just read the box, but I chose not to. So it has the instructions inside as well, which is super handy. I don't know if I'll ever do this, but I'll probably do it when I'm bored, the weaving kit. And now we have a circle or oval photo card of Jong Hyun, which is so cool, I believe. As well as a photo card of Dino. And then another photo card of Jong Hyun. And then we have a sort of like postcard of Sangwon and um, Jun. Sorry, I stutter a lot, so you have to forgive me. And then we have a big photo card of Wonwoo. And then we have a circle photo card of the eight. And this is like a postcard or mini poster of the whole group. And then like a little sticker of semicolon. I will probably be putting this on my laptop. And then we have the CD. The struggle putting it back in okay now to look into the actual photo book so yeah i kind of realized it late that this whole book was dedicated to dk you'll see that later in the video but like i enjoyed the whole aesthetic of the album as well like especially like the mustardy yellows and blues put together and all the photography it's like really inspiring as well so yeah and then here's the lyrics as well in the back oh so wait this whole book is dedicated to dk oh that's so cool when you, they're trying to get you to like your bias trick, I think. On and off spin-off album. So here is the spin-off album. I love the reflectiveness of the CD. Okay. And there's the back of it, the lyrics. Aww. <laughs> I got... Okay. I 
got you and I got MK and I'm really happy. Yes, as you saw, I pulled MK, which was previously my old bias, and then I pulled you. My, my bias now in the group is Wyatt, so yes, I was very happy when I pulled those. So in the photo book, I extremely like the whole photography used in it, especially like the whole like galaxy kind of look and the neon lights, like it was definitely like a, a positive for me. And yeah. yeah. So that is the on and off ouch. It came with two photo files and I'm very happy. None of a counter being like, I'm very happy. I'm very happy. Yeah, can you do a nice counter and a happy counter? <laughs> the DKB album but I always get jinxed because I get the same photo card every time. I always get Yuku, the Japanese member, which I also do adore. He's so cute. But I do wish I get Tail, which is my bias in the group. So this is the DKB album. Yes, I was very excited to unbox this album. I've been waiting for it for a very long time and I love the whole aesthetic of the group itself and yeah. And now you can see like most of the members and yeah. <laughs> I just turned to the photo card. You know how I said I wanted to get a member? Mm -hmm. I got him. Nice. So yes, as you can see from my blushing mess, I got Teo, which is my bias, and I was very indeed happy about that. I also managed to pull Harry Jun, and he is another one of my favourites in the group. And here is a postcard of most of the members, and a sticker pack, which I will probably never use, but I will enjoy. So as we look through the photo book, it has a nice like work aesthetic, which is what the album's going for, and industrial as well. But I really enjoyed most of the photography used in this photo book. Like it's personally one of my favorites that this group has like produced. And yeah, I do love the neon look as well. And that's it. So next we are gonna have the SF9 special history book. And it is another special album, like the 17 one. So yes, this is one of the special books from SF9, and it is celebrating four years of them being together. I was so happy when I actually managed to see this group in person, so that's a big plus for me. So as we pull some of the photo cards, we have Jaehyun, and then we have Insyong. Yes, and then we also have young and I was very excited to pull him as well as well as the other members so yes I also want to apologize that my voiceover is probably really bad but as I said this is my first time so please bear with me and yes yeah, so this is photo book is memory like remembering all the history <laughs> wow the historical days of SF9 so yeah I wanted to show as much as I could and some of my favorite areas which was like Mamma Mia and it's like the, the recent one as well so yeah I really enjoyed this book, so yes. In this album, my ultimate bias, Lee Hong Gil, is in it. So I'm very excited about this album, and I'm just very excited about this group in general because they are all amazing. It does upset me that I am older than most of these boys, but hey, that's just a technicality that we can't look into right now. Mental crisis. So yes, after that little crisis, here is the album. It is very nice. I really don't know what to say when it comes to un voiceovering, so please forgive me. So here is like a little pre-order gif, I assume, that comes with the album. So like a little photo book of all the members and... I hate how you're 10 days older than me. He's very attractive. He's very attractive. He's no, not ten days older. He's ten days younger than me. He's still very attractive. Yeah. After that, that was a bit of a crisis as well. But they're all the members, and I extremely love all of them as well. They're so cute. So yes. And another pre-order gift, I assume. So first we have Jamin. <laughs> then we have Hangyu. I'm very happy. Yes. Yeah, so yes. that's Hangyu. Yujun, then Musen, and then there's Junso, Yongso, then Doha, and then we have cute little bit, and last we have Donghyun. So now actually unboxing the album we have. 
think it's helping fall out. <laughs> okay. Oh, we get a member on the cover as well. I didn't know that. Yes, I was very surprised to find Jamin on my cover of the album, but I really did enjoy it. I'm guessing this is where the CD is kept. Yeah. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> the big photo card of the guy I like. So yes, I managed to get Hangul and two of the other members, which is so exciting, and I did enjoy this as well. I loved everything that came with, like the stickers as well, they were so nice to look at. And this mini poster of all the members as well, and I'm pretty sure on the back it had the lyrics of all the songs, so that was pretty cool. And here's some photo cards, so we have Minsun. I'm sorry if I pronounced his name wrong, <laughs> I'm still learning all the members. And then we have Donghyun. So cute, I love his little pose that he does. And then again we have Minsun. Minsun? Please correct me if I'm wrong, I'm so sorry. And yeah. And then into the photo book, I'm probably going to show off Hong Yul a bit, so I'm sorry about that, but he is my ultimate bias. I did love the whole photography that was used in this book, and the colours as well. Like, I love the whole green on green, and then like, the member sitting on the, the chair, so. I did not expect for like, one of the members to be on like, the album itself, so like, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Lift the back up a little bit. You're gonna. Yeah. Next, we're gonna be unboxing the Treasure albums. I am very excited for these. Um, I've been standing in the group since not even when they debuted, since they were like Treasure Box. So the group, the show, the survival show they were on. And I'm very excited. So one of the members in this group is called Yoshi, and I legit adore him. He's like one of my favorites. And if anything, if he becomes like if I get him as a photo card, <laughs> I told you I'm a yeet shit. Mm. So yes, this is Treasure's newest album. Um, right now we're just testing the reflectiveness of the dark version. <laughs> so the. On the back of photo cards, they have the name, mm -hmm. so it's not a really big point of like lifting it from the back. But um, I got, I got Yoshi. <laughs> so yes, I managed to pull Yoshi, which made me super super excited. I genuinely love this man. I was so happy when I did. I'm very happy. I don't really get him as a photo card often, and when the albums came out, and I'm very very happy that I got him. Keep him close to my heart. And then we got a reflective photo of Yidam, which is so cool. I love the whole reflectiveness. And then Asashi, another one of my biases. So, yes, hold him gently. <laughs> I have another photo card of Yoshi. <laughs> it's, very, it's a very nice photo card too. So I'm being um, blessed or I don't know what, but um, I feel like I'm going red in the face. Cause like, I don't, is it getting hot in here? <laughs> it actually feels like it's getting hot. No, it's not. <laughs> yes, I felt very lucky to pull Yoshi again, so and I do enjoy this card as well. And last, we have a photo card of Jihun. So yeah. And then we have the scratch it win, and then this little thing, and then a sticker. So into the actual album, I actually love the whole layout and the bookmark they pull with the album, and the pastel aesthetic that comes with it, and this. Just this. What is this? Oh, okay. It does in the last album too, but like, it's holographic. Ooh, you love reflectiveness. Yes, I love how them. Simply. Yes, this whole reflectiveness. And I don't know, this whole album just like screamed my aesthetic. And it comes with a mini poster as well. I'll, I'll be probably putting that up in my room. And now onto the dark album. <sighs> the reflectiveness is so beautiful. And then we have Haruto. And then we have Hyungsuk. And then Jae Hyuk. And then Yidam. And then another photo of Yidam. A sticker, very nice. And another scratch it. And this, we couldn't figure out what it was, but we'll investigate later. And then another mini poster. And another beautiful reflectiveness of all the members. And again, looking into the album, I just fell in love with it straight away. It was so aesthetically pleasing, and the, the effects I put in the photo album, it's just beautiful. Essentially everything I said, you break that. I'm not gonna break it. I'm trying to figure out what it is. Is it to hold your photo card? 
I think so. I'm not 100% sure, but it's a very shitty design if it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do CXI, the next album. Mm -hmm. This is the third chapter as well, so like the Treasure Own, it's the third chapter. When you get the full set of the albums on the side here, when you link them up with the other albums, it makes the logo. Oh. So once you get like the whole set, it'll make the whole logo. Is this be the way around? No, it's red. Oh. I don't know. I don't know the logo, so I can't answer. No, you're right. It's supposed to be that way. So yes, we have the two albums, a red and blue version, and again, this has a nice hollow effect on it. Look at that shimmer. So we have a nice pin that comes with the album, as well as a group photo card of all the members. Yes. So nice. And then we have Sung Hyun. Yes, I was very excited to pull him as well. And then we have a nice postcard. Who's the blue hair boy? Blue hair boy is Jin Young. Yeah. <laughs> of all the members, which Jada got very excited for. And then we have a bunch of stickers and then a nice postcard which has a description on the back of it so it's very lovely and sweet then we have a poster of sung Hyun, which i was very excited to receive and flipping through the photo book i'm going to try and show you all the members i love the whole aesthetic of like the Ro roman numerals on the side so yes they were very nice to look at now the red album was personally my favorite out of the two so we have another pin from it and another group photo which is very nice indeed yes you're gonna we're gonna keep looking at it? Okay, cool. And then we have my Bias BX. I was very excited to receive him as a photo card. I hardly get him either, so yes. I loved this postcard. It was just very aesthetically pleasing. The whole red album was so nice to look at. The stickers, and then again, the same one with the same writing on the back. And then we have a post of Jin Young. I'll send you details of this group. Thank you, my appreciate. <laughs> Indeed, I did send the details of the group. <laughs> and now we have the photo book. And again, this whole red aesthetic with the, like the jungle so aesthetically pleasing to me and the photography used the lights i seriously want to try this one day and yes this is what it looks like properly when you hold the album together so there's a bookmark oh that makes more sense now so this there's a bookmark you looked up on the album didn't you like yeah. the little list yeah <laughs> on to nct 2020 version. I'll put up the two members as well that came into the group. Shotaro and Sangsha. And personally, I adore them both. They are so cute, especially Shotaro. Like, yeah. I'll also put like up the TikTok of them. Up the TikTok, yep. So here is the 2020 albums of NCT. Again, this was a very unique way to package an album, especially the spine of it. So here is a few pages of the photo book. I need to show off my bias soon. Oh, look at Johnny shirtless. There's Tail, my bias. So lovely. And yeah, there's Lucas, of course, with his shirt off as well. But yes, it was very nice to look at. I love the aesthetic as well. I'm using the word aesthetic a lot, but yeah. I also want to apologize. I couldn't find the footage for this part for this other album. So you're going to have to enjoy it from this one. And then we have a little lyric booklet as well, or pamphlet of everything that's in the album. And yeah, so in this album, I received Rujun which is like my bias from NCT Dream, as well as Jamin, so yeah. Watch my speed pick up. I got Kun, which is one of my biases in the group, and I'm very happy because I rarely get a Kun photo card of him, and yeah. That looks cool though. I like yeah. the way they framed it. Yeah. So yes, I got Kun, who is my bias in Wavy, and I was very, very happy to get him as this photo card with a reflectiveness border and everything. So pretty. And now onto the second album of the group, the set, sorry. And yeah, I love the whole orange aesthetic as well. I am so sorry if I'm using the word orange too much. Orange, wow. Aesthetic too much. So yeah. So all these are all the members as well from the photo book. And yeah, I love the photography used as well. It's so good. Yeah. And in onto photo cards, we had Chan Yil, which is very nice. I don't get many photo cards of him, so I was very happy. And Yang Yang. I get too many photo cards of him. So yeah, I was very happy to get him as well though. So overall, I enjoyed the album. So, this one, open like this. 